Right, so this is a tutorial on how to change sizing on your web page for smartphones, tablets, etc. Um, so essentially we have a, a PC sized uh, web page, everything's quite big as you can see. And then we can minimize it. Of course minimize the size um, and as we get smaller when we reach smartphone bang whoa, it switches so the text gets smaller the picture gets smaller um, and we could probably push this up higher as well so yeah if that's something you want to do then keep watching Right, so um, <clears throat> if we go to our um, standard page that we've been using, kitten and pup, uh, <clears throat> I've just used the about page that I created. So double click that. Oh, watch out. Um, <clears throat> And all I've done is I've made the sizes a little bigger, um, just so that the example is a bit more obvious. So you've got, and I've added this picture of um, uh, this big, big cat, uh, and I've also added some uh, text. So once upon a time there was. A big old cat named Arthur. He loved to frolic and play amongst the willow trees every afternoon after school. However, one day, as he was strolling about the trees, there appeared a gigantic and most chunky female beast. Arthur pondered for a moment, and then suddenly he pounced upon the beast and cuddled with her. Uh, I've also added um, some margins <coughs> just to give it a bit of spacing but by now you should know how to do all that if you don't <coughs> look at tutorial A or B on how to make uh, the, you know the website from scratch okay so let's take a look at what it looks like on the web. Here it is. So you can see on the PC sized screen, or on a big screen, um, it works fine. It looks good. Um, a good sized um, uh, cat there on Arthur. But then when we shrink it, um, nothing, nothing happens. So it, it is responsive. Um, we've established that in earlier tutorials so things do move um, you can see um, well because I've made this box a percentage size that works um, and you can see the cats move to the top it hasn't stayed on the side of the text and that's because we used a responsive group so that's good and maybe you want to keep it that way but for me this is far too big for a smartphone screen. So the things it won't change are text size. Um, if you use the frame for your image and not a uh, an image for your element, um, and you made it a percentage size, it would have become smaller, which can be good. Um, but not usually so good when you have it side by side with something else because you can imagine if this is a percentage okay I will show you quickly um, so let's change the size of the image to 50 percent <coughs> mm. Okay, let's make him 20%. And 
and the height. 20%, okay, maybe not 20%. Uh, auto. Uh, really? Okay. Let's just leave it. <clears throat> um, let's see what happens now. Mm. Okay, yeah. Uh, no. That's not what I wanted. Yeah, okay, so <clears throat> I think um yeah, okay, I've I've changed it on the smartphone settings already, that's why, but normally um this is exactly what'll happen. Even on the smartphone size, it'll just get smaller, which is good. That's really responsive, that's really nice, actually. But because it's side by side with the text, it's just going to get smaller and smaller and smaller. We don't want that. That doesn't really look good. So, <clears throat> let's do it. So that's what it's like on my main page. I'm happy with that. Now, we click on Media. And you might want to change it for tablets, small tablets, and smartphones so that it gets slightly smaller for each one. For this example, to keep things simple, I'm just going to change it for smartphones. And if you don't know much about that, you should probably watch the um, tutorial C, 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 what was it? Uh, where are you? C5 on smartphone menus. Um, and that goes into a bit about smartphone sizing as well. Anyway, let's make this as quick and painless as possible. So I'm just going to change the size of the text here to 32. Make this one 24. Uh, I'm going to make the big cat. Uh, let's make him... I don't know, 200, is that too big? 150 by 150. And let's make the text come on. Let's make this text um, the main text smaller as well. Let's say 18. Okay, now that's looking a little more appropriate. I also want to <coughs> reduce these margins. Um, so select them both top. Let's make it 10. Okay. And lastly, I think the group is too far from the top as well. Let's make it 150. Mm. Yeah, okay. Now, the other thing is the width. Uh, I don't want the width to be pixels. Okay, that's, that's important. I want the width of the text box to be... Because what you'll see will happen. I'll show you. There's all these little things when it comes to sizing that will drive you absolutely nuts. But this is 2018. This is what you have to do because of smartphones. So as I get smaller, yeah, you start to see we get a horizontal scroll bar. Now, pretty much um, any good web design should never ever ever have a horizontal scroll bar on any screen um, so what we can do and in fact I'll yeah okay now that's fine what I'll do is make the width a percentage even 90% 
is is good. I'll, I'll say eighty percent. Okay, and I'll do the same here. That's looking a little big. Let's keep it neat. Um, and yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Let's save it and take a look. Now, had you have changed the sizing up here? Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> you can try that for yourself. See what happens. It's just a bug in the program. It just doesn't really work. Okay, now that's looking pretty good. Okay, so you can see if we make it bigger. I said if we make it bigger. Okay, it's good. It looks pretty good. And then, uh, yeah, okay, that's better. <clears throat> So you can see as you get within the range of the smartphone. Now, you, again, you could put this on a tablet so that when it reaches this point, it changes. But I've only made it for a smartphone, not for a tablet. So only when you get below 480 pixels. And again, if you don't understand that, watch the previous tutorial. When I get below 480 pixels width, it's going to switch. Just about any time now. This is going horrendously slow. Come on. <laughs> hey, there we go. Beautiful. Okay, now stop. Please. Thank you. Oh, Arthur. What are you doing? What are you doing, buddy? Okay, beautiful. So that's pretty much what it's going to look like on a uh, smartphone. Look at that. Yeah, so that's pretty much it for sizing on a smartphone.